Oh, it's got an X plate, but it's not an X dealer plate. Mm. How do you like that guy starting to film me? A ride here, my friend's Lincoln. Who am I staying? Yeah, right here on Saint Jacques and uh, Cavendish. Look at that Mustang next to a Saab. That's a good-looking car. I always liked these later model Saabs. Just too bad they were fucking junk, absolute garbage. Are you choosing not to say anything, or uh, what, do say anything. what do you think? <laughs> what do you think of these new Camrys? They look better than the older ones. Almost sometimes I think that the Toyota, people at Toyota saw my videos. I complained about how fucking boring Japanese cars become, become, have become. Hachu! Yeah, it just won't come. <laughs> That's what she said. Yeah, you know. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Come on. Yeah, this used to be a national rental car right here. Now we're at Merson Automotive. We used to hear Lisa Christensen always plug, and of course, here's a New building, can't stop progress. Metropolitan rust proofing. Never heard anything good about metropolitan rust proofing. And these, some of these guys I used to know, but they're closed for the season. And as I was telling my buddy here, I know some good people own that LaBelle Provence. Man, we should almost go eat and breakfast there, actually. Have good breakfast there, actually. If you're starving. This used to be Picasso's restaurant. Used to have great, great food, great breakfast, and all that. Of course, the Amazon strip club is still there. This guy, I was too late, dude. This guy was a used car dealer for the longest time, and recently, look, it got cleared out. Must have got bought out. He had a fucking 70s MCI coach back there, and, and I should have went back there. To, should have went there sooner to, to, to film it. And PJ's is still here. Now, there's a used car dealer coming up right here, and I saw a fucking 80s BMW 635. Parked here, uh, it's gone. Oh, he's got an old Jag there, though. Let's see. Yeah, it's gone. I guess somebody must have scooped that up pretty fast. Well, what about a neck? What is this boring vehicle here at the light here? <laughs> what tabarnak? Uh, tabarnak! Hey, you know what I just realized? You could actually... Shit, you could have turned right here. You could have turned left here. Take the 20, I think. Get back on the 20 I'm and gonna go. I'm going to go in here and then... Uh... Yeah, why not? Try it out. Okay. Oh, my God. Let me think for a second. What do they call this street? It says... Helen, Helen Rochester. Rochester. What the hell was that? Is she related to the Rochester carburetors? <laughs> Imagine. The gangsta, y'all. Yeah, right. <laughs> gang, gang. He, he emul emulates the look, like so many people. Now, this street, they re recently redid it like a year or two ago. It used to be absolute shite. Thank God. Hey, you know what? You want to do me a favor? I want you to go through one of these alleyways here. Turn right? One of the back alleys here. Um, no, you're going to see it, I think, right between these buildings here on the right. Because I seen an old Thunderbird back there. I want to see if it's still there. Uh... Yeah, was this one or the one next to it? Oh, shit. Here, I'll turn, I'll turn right. Uh, that's a one-way. Yeah, right here. No, you passed both of them. That's a ah. one-way. I can't do it. Here, we'll go here. Let's film the garbage man here. There you go for your garbage fans. I hope you didn't see me. Hey, did I ever tell you about this garbage man one time though? That he uh, yeah he saw me uh, he saw my video of him in the video and he's like I'll oh, remove it or I'm gonna take a class action lawsuit against you. Well, he didn't he didn't say that. But he'd say I was gonna take a legal action against you. I got a lot of respect for these guys, so it's a shitty job. Somebody's gotta do it. Hey, I wonder if my friend Marco is driving the 123 over here. Let's see if I can see him from here with my zoom. Well, they're nicely paid, and uh, you know they they get to work out and stuff like that. There, they're out there working out. I can't tell if it's him or not. Shit! No, I can't tell. Damn, blasted eyesight! You got a Mustang or something like that? What oh, look, a BMW. 
Look, it's an old Beamer there. Look at that. Hey, there's a Nissan Pulsar NX. Did you see that? Look. The white car. 80s, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Uh, no, uh, go straight. You're going to turn, I think, in the next alleyway. Oh. Told you, there's some old stuff around here, you know? That's what's great about these old alleyways. They're great places to put vehicles that don't run. <laughs> turn here? No, turn at the next alley. It should be right here where that red, red, car. red Grand Am is. There's one of these on my street, actually. I don't like see Otherwise, we can always come back on this street and do the other alley, too. Yeah. Or even actually we'll go up the alley. There we go. We're gonna get them all. All three. Okay, I'm gonna read that. I feel like a private investigator. I know. We're trying to, we're trying to check out something. Where were you on the night of June 6th? Here. Oh, Cadillac. Big ass. Okay, if I saw that T-Bird, it was in the other alley. It wasn't in this one because I remember it was parked on that side. We got a Cadillac STS coming up here. Oh, look at this fucking thing. STS? <laughs> Two Cadillacs. Three Cadillacs. Okay, I forgot yeah, to I mention. I forgot to mention. There's a lot of brothers and sisters that live around here, so this <laughs> maybe have something to do with it. And of course, somebody's gonna say, "You're fucking racist, you ignorant jerk." No, it has nothing to do with that. Where are you going? Around the bump. Oh, okay. Ooh. Ooh. What the fuck is doing? that? Doing What's that thing? Here, huh? It is on oh, Civic. No, it's a yeah, it's a Beamer. It's a Beamer. It's three series, yeah. Yeah, seen no. better days. She's seen better days. Okay, it's a little hot in here. You mind turning the fucking heat? You want a couch? Yeah, like I said, this street used to be one of the worst fucking streets in the city. It was so horrible. And I think what happened was maybe they redid it because I think I had heard that uh, the STM threatened the city a few times and said, hey, you know, if you don't fix these streets, we're going to cancel our service, our bus service on your routes. I'm serious. Yeah, this is where I saw that T-Bird. It was a late 80s T-Bird, late 80s, early 90s, and I really liked those cars. The last time I saw one was in uh, St. Lamb Isle there, somebody's driveway. Ooh, she's sliding. What's this model? I always forget. It's a Nissan, eh? This one? This one? It's a Toyota. I can't oh, tell. something's covered up there. Just wrapped it up. Oh, there's people there. Yeah, we're filming. Prospecting! They look like landlords, actually. <laughs> they don't look like they live here. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I guess that T Bird's oh, gone, eh? Maybe it was sold or went to scrap. Well, I'm glad the sun is shining. I don't know why I didn't expect it today. Maybe it's because it's this time of year where it's always fucking shite. No, wait till the end of the night there. We're gonna get some shit tonight. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. They're saying five, ten centimeters, if that even. Probably be more freezing rain than anything. You know? Okay. You know, if, if we can find a parking lot with some ice there like this. That would be funny. You, know, you gotta get out of the car there, and I'd, li I'd like to yeah. get a video of this car doing a burnout. Well, we'll see if we can find that. Oh, look, there's an old Dodge there. Old Dodge uh, B200. Uh, you want to go over there or you want to do the, the other alley? No, keep this way. Next alley? No, no, no. Uh, I think we did it, didn't we? No, there's another one. Snowden. There's, uh, there's another alley uh, right here with this BMW. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's where that Nissan Pulsar NX yeah. Uh, it is. Yeah, yeah. I had an ad for one of those. If you want hell, get out and just do a little walk here. And nah. Because no? I'm getting hungry. Oh. I mean, if they were really rare cars, I would film that Beamer's nice, yeah, though. This Beamer's dropped and everything. It's freaking nice. Man, a Nissan NX, fuck. Jeez. Last time I saw one of those was at a car show, I think. Eh, I still see one time at a time. Fuck. Nah, there's nothing here. Nope. It's kind of weird how these cars are parked, eh? Sebring, fucking Chrysler nothing is what it is. It's such a nothing car. People think the 300 is bad. Huh. It's a shame because the 300 looked like a, you know. It, no, it's a beautiful it car, a but car. it would be, it's, it's, it's I, I hear it's a money pit, you know. Then I, again, I heard the opposite. I've heard they're great cars. You know, so make a right here and we'll, uh, Head to the restaurant, though, because I'm getting a little 
a little hungry there. Keep an eye out for the pedestrians. They're, they're vulnerable. This there. used to be a seal test uh, milk uh, factory. Right here. Now it's Parmalat, which is still milk. One of my favorite things. That would be funny. What am I speaking to kids? And one of my fan lives here. He's uh, 17. Look, there is an Impala, which is funny because the guy I thought it might be driving the 123. That's what he has, which is very strange for a guy his age, actually. And that's uh, it. Wasn't enough though. It wasn't enough to, uh, you know, keep the company in good standing. Really, it's just like I said it before. I mean, that's why Chrysler is not closing plants because they don't make great fucking cars. They make cool cars, and trucks, but GM doesn't. Period. Alright, where do we go here? Just uh, follow the road. Alright, farewell. Well. Okay, they didn't redo this part here. And this light over here is recent. There it is. God damn. Yeah. <laughs> truck. What? Big truck back there. Uh, what big truck? The Chevy. The Chevy in the Ford? There. The Chevy, it's got the that six wheel. Uh, Oh yeah, you're right. Yeah, it's a dually. You're right. That's for hauling trailers. You can see the guy's got the mirrors on there. Uh, workhorse. Yeah, now we're driving into... Uh, we're going to drive into Viz St. Pierre. If it was a place to park, I would tell you to park the car because this is we're going over the CN line here. But I can't exactly park here yet. The CN main line, I should say. I was here a couple weeks ago. I didn't have any luck though. I'm gonna show you a fucking rusted out Toyota Celica from like I don't know 78 to like yeah, early yeah. 80s. It's right over here. You're gonna slow yeah. slow down there. You're gonna see it's right here. Right? Yeah, right there. Holy fuck. You saw, yeah, it's, that's the thing. You can't really get a look at it because it's too dangerous. Why? Oh, I saw it. There's no traffic behind it. The limit here is actually like 30 or 40s. You know what? Let's for fun see what's around here. I used to live I used to live here, actually. So make make a right at the next street, which is where I used to live, called Zuchelet, and then we'll, then we'll go have breakfast. Very good. Yeah, now we're on Saint-Jacques and Zuchelet. And you see that bell there? Yeah. That, that used to be a church, and it was it burnt down. That they saved the bell. It's a chapelle. It's still a. Yeah, it, well, it is, but they used to be a really like a church church, you know. Yeah, and I used to live between 2009, 2013. I lived right here. Yeah, right there on the third floor. Didn't uh, didn't have much more of a view, unfortunately. Noisy area, Christ. I mean, you had the noise from Saint Jacques Street, especially at rush hour. You had the noise from Highway 20. I'm like, holy Christ. You know, there was a guy. See this house here, which really sticks out. I, I have a feeling it wasn't originally built here. I don't know. It doesn't look like it should be here. But there was. I took a photo one time of Lincoln, like yours, '90s Lincoln Town Car. Beautiful condition. I'll let you decide which way to go here. Look at this Dodge. Eh? Uh, you know what? Let's, let's go right. I bet you that thing's got a Cummins in it. That's the popular thing to do there. Vida St. Pierre, this is a, once again still in the working class area. And we're at, uh, oh yeah, Rue Boyer. Boyer. Let's see what we got over here. And then make a left at that street there actually. Yeah, once again, shite roads. This is, uh, this street is called, uh, oh god, Des 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 There's a little e excavator, is that what we call it? I remember one time I took a picture of a gorgeous Chevy, uh, late 70s Chevy dump truck. And medium duty, and it was amazing, the condition of it. It was redone. I see scrap. Guys chatting by the truck there. No, no, no. Ah, transit scrap. Oh, non Oh, old Mercedes. Mercedes. Yeah, 90s. 
Oh, oh, police. Well, that's got to be expected around here. Oh, no, it's not police. I don't know what that is. Now they're giving parking tickets. I don't know, it's your STM. STM. The stupid transit mofos. <laughs> oh, snap, make a left here, actually. Because that's a one way. Yeah, I don't want to go. Homies up I there smoking some, some weed. Yeah, smoking the herbs. It's legal now here in Canada, by the way, guys, if you're not familiar with that. Uh, good looking Impala. Good looking piece of junk. I saw in Kijiji, I think on my street a few months back, six months ago or so, there was a guy selling a. I don't know, 80 something Cadillac Fleetwood Brougham is white, typical white. They're always white, those cars. And then make a left here. We're back on uh, uh, Saint Jacques. This restaurant here used to be called Le Roi Georges. See, it's funny because this is the only part of town I ever lived here. No, no, left, left. Did I say right? I meant left. No, no, I'm going left. It's, just, I it's the only part of town I've lived here twice. What's all these cars parked here? Oh, I hear that. I hear something. Yeah, I hear an ambulance or something. Yeah, where is it? Oh, wow. Probably on the highway. Fucking lights red in the stopping lines all the way back here. <laughs> oh, yeah, don't eat here. When I used to live down here, I ate here one time. Fuck, man, I had... Uh... Where? What's this pizza? No, right here, La Belle Province. This crap place there. Fuck, I had these fries, they were hard as a rock, they were terrible, they were expired, and oh my god, I was so sick here, I had, uh, uh, what do you call it, um, food poisoning. Not fun. This is Highway 20. Sure. Where you go? Yeah, go straight through. Okay. Oh, actually, oh, fuck, it's true, you can't make it left there. Can you make it, yeah, make it left here, sorry, if you can. My bad, sorry about that. I'm gonna go on Notre Dame, La Rue Notre Dame, Notre Dame. Well, I'm glad your car's clean, especially the windows, you know? Timmy's! Now, this building, this really long building coming up on the right here. This is of importance to the transportation enthusiasts, enthusiasts also, especially of Montreal, is that this used to be the Canadian Car and Foundry Building. This is where they made the transit buses up until 61. They also made trucks, heavy trucks. They made planes, streetcars. Look how long this building goes for. It's incredible. Unbelievable. You're not saying anything. You don't care. Well, I'm just checking it out. Check it, check it, check it out, check it out. Look at this luxuriousness of this beast. Okay, she's not a beast, but she's she's a beast like the way she behaves sometimes because she's got so much <clears throat> torque and power. What's the power again on that motor? Uh, 239 horsepower, and I think we're at about 300 square pounds feet of torque. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh. Got some herb. How many people do you think go up to that truck driver and ask him that? Do you have any herbs? You know, like when they have in the summertime that company Weed Man? They go to spray the weeds. They got any weed, man? Oh, man, I bet they get that shit all the time. Yeah, it's not the most uh, glorious part of the city, that's for sure. Such a wonderful ride, Kevin. I don't think I would see you being able to go from this to like a Civic or a CRV after, you know? I wouldn't. <laughs> I don't think you'd be able to. Man, I'm thrilled. A great timing for you to come today, you know? I mean, as you know, the weather's been so crummy. It's like one day's nice, one day's bad, one day's nice, one day. Well, I've been you really know? busy and I've been meaning to I a call at some point. It's just, fuck, it's just the holidays and. Saturday I went out in the morning and I went out earlier because I knew it was going to cloud over and then at one point it did cloud over at about, I don't know, oh, 11 or something. Yeah, that's all the construction for Highway 20. 
And uh, yeah, and then I got demotivated by the clouds, and I'm like, fuck it, I went home. <laughs> so I'm like, screw that. Believe it or not, I've actually hung out on this overpass before because it goes over to CN train line, and again, I could film a lot of trucking here too. But it's a bit nerve wracking from all the noise next to you, you know? And this is Angrignon, or Le Boulevard Angrignon. Quebec, I see it should be 60. See the, the train, the CN train line used to be right here, right next to that barrier, and they just they had to move everything because to reconfigure the Turcot interchange. They're still doing it. Well, they moved all the fucking tracks. This guy's tailgating me. What do they call this? Fast Mr. fucking uh, CX-5, I heard that's a shit car anyway. Oh, look at this guy. He's got one of them Toyotas there that I was thinking about. It's a Celica, isn't it? That's what I think it is. I always thought it looked kind of sharp. A little bit boring on the rear. I just had an 80s song pop in my head. You're a strange animal. That's what I know. Oh man, it's going to be good. So wait, bon, it's the same. Is your girlfriend French or not? Yeah. Well, she is, eh? Quebecois, but you know, she speaks... Uh, she so speaks you, so have you been able to uh, improve your French due to this, or...? Um... Uh, maybe. <laughs> maybe. I've probably learned a couple, couple new things. Is there anything, ever anything you miss about Cornwall? Nope. <laughs> Nothing at all, really? Uh, unfortunately, no, not really. Wow. You know, it's a small city, it's a little bit... It's a little bit trashy, sorry. Sorry to say, but it's kind of it's kind of yeah, ghetto. but yeah, but you got trashy people in a lot of places, you know. Okay, you're gonna make a right at the that the light coming up there. The light? Yeah, the light coming up there. That's uh, a monk street. M O N K. That spells monk. There's the Kruger uh, recycling plant. I remember I took a picture one time. There was a 80, 81 Pontiac Parisienne park there. Well, you mustn't get too bad at mileage. I mean, you don't drive like a maniac, you know? I mean, you look, you're driving nice and easy. You're gonna want to get over in the right lane, though. But... Not the best, because I mostly drive in the city. I drive, no, uh, I, know. I never take this car out on the highway. I'm always in the city of Laval. So, uh... Also, I let the, I have got a remote, a remote starter, so the car will sit idle more than it should. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't have the best gas mileage, but it is pretty good. Right, right, right. Now we're right. Doing, right now we're doing pretty, pretty great, probably. There's one of these rounded off cube trucks. They're kind of, they're kind of interesting. They're kind of weird. You can see why that didn't take off too far. Well. So I try not to beat the shit out of the car because I don't have any money right now to fix it for we're in a break. Well, yeah, I, don't, I think you told me you didn't have much happen to it eh, since you've had it. Um, not really, no. No, so, so far it's been pretty good. You know, I've had obviously some maintenance done to it there, but it was all stuff that I knew had to be done when I bought the car. So. Yeah, we're almost there. Check out this mural here. Woo! And an old Pontiac Transport we just passed. Charger. And an Intrepid, both at a garage. <laughs> that says it all. It's too bad about those Intrepids. I like those cars. It gets such a bad rap. You know? It's coming up there. I think it's the next light. Look at this a golden Lexus. What the hell is this? Eglise. It's a church, soon to be church or mosque. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Weird, uh, sushi. Spelled wrong. Well, guys, we're almost at our destination and we're starving. We both have not had breakfast, so, uh, even though it's like one o'clock probably. So, I uh, hope you guys had uh, enjoyed this uh, nice ride here and, uh, 
There you can see the town car's reflection in the glass there. I was hoping for that. Here, it's right here. I uh, know, sorry. It's right here. Right, we just passed it. Sorry about that. I uh, <laughs> This area confuses me sometimes. Uh, it's all good. All right, guys. So, uh, anyway, uh, Happy New Year and uh, Happy Festivus. Bye.